Good Thursday morning everyone starting out nice and quiet. No threat for rain across the area today. Hadn't been able to say that a lot over the last week, but we are unfortunately contending with a little bit of patchy dense fog. Notice zero mile visibility now in Flint. Also in Claire, one in Bay City and Cairo. So watch out for that. Remember to slow your speeds. But as we go towards sunrise, which is a little before eight o'clock, we'll start to see the fog tapering off shortly after that. The sun will definitely be helping with it. Also helping us with getting temperatures a little higher. Can you believe we're into the mid 20s right now in Tawas and in Claire at 24, the coldest we've seen so far this season. 26 in Bad Axe, it's 27 in Cairo. We're at 30 in Flint and Saginaw, 31 in Bay City. So definitely a chilly start to the day, the coldest again so far this season. But with sunshine after the fog tapers off, we're going to see a quick recovery in temperatures thanks to high pressure that'll keep us cloud free, at least for the majority of the day today. So the high settling right overhead that's going to block this system from bringing its rain to the east and meaning that we'll see a lot of sunshine today and your temperatures will climb up into the 50s. But as we go into the latter part of our day, cl close to sunrise, we're going to be watching for that partial solar eclipse. Make sure you have the protective eyewear. Don't stare directly at the sun because, of course, we know the damage that that can do. But if you do have those glasses, about 530 ish is when we'll start to see that eclipse happening and notice by two we're still looking clear by five 530 will still be clear a little shortly after that though we'll start to see some of the clouds approaching from out west but rain chances limited to only a sprinkle or two during the overnight hours i think the real thing that we'll see from this the bigger threat is going to be the clouds, which isn't necessarily a threat because cloud cover at night acts like your nice warm blanket in your bed. It's going to keep the heat down here at the surface. So overnight lows into the upper 30s and low 40s as opposed to the upper 20s. Some of us into the mid 20s like right now. Now as we look through your seven day forecast, we are expecting lots of sunshine, a few clouds tomorrow, more sun over the weekend. Temperatures kind of all over the place for the next few days, back and forth between the 50s and 60s. But at least we do have a dry weekend ahead. Looks like Saturday is going to be pretty windy out there as well. So keep that in mind for your outdoor plans. Next rain chance Tuesday.